Here in Boston, we love our marathon and we celebrate our runners. Many of the professional runners become household names. Dez, Meb, Bill, Shalane, and Tatiana is one of those names. She was our second place women's wheelchair finisher today. Tatiana McFadden, a five-time Boston champion. David Wade with her now. David? Lisa, I have to say that with this assignment, one of my favorite people to talk to each and every year is the Boston Marathon legend, Tatiana McFadden. As you mentioned, Lisa, five-time winner. How did you feel out on the course today? It was tough. I don't know why I thought this was a good idea. Um, 52.4 miles in 24 hours, um, but I, I felt Boston strong today. The energy was just incredible throughout the whole course. I mean, mile 20 was pretty hard, and uh, but I'll, I'll come back and I'll, I'll win this race again. But this was quite a challenge, and the only elite female athlete to do it i was up for it so i'm pretty happy with second today i cannot complain and uh yeah it was, it was tough so she says 52 miles in two days i think we have some video chicago marathon was yesterday tatiana won the chicago marathon yesterday decided to come here you've never in your professional career done two marathons in two days never i never have um so this was definitely an extra extra challenge um Manuela stayed just to do Boston. I thought, what the heck? Sign me up for all of them. This is going to be awesome. Um, I'm in pain. My back really hurts. But uh, it, I'm so glad I did it. Um, I know that I can do it. And so it's going to look bright for the future of my training and uh, see what I can tweak. And uh, yeah, I love coming back to Boston. I would never miss it. So I'm so happy I came. One of the things you can tweak is never do two marathons in two days. Maybe, but I would definitely always do Boston, so, yep, that's correct. And it's been four marathons in 16 days. That's correct as well, yep. So I podiumed all of them, a uh, great win yesterday, second place today. Um, it's been an incredible year, um, three medals from the Paralympics, so the season is uh, ending, but it's ending on a high note. You know, we've had, uh, obviously, our fair share of very emotional marathons over the past decade. Um, what was the feeling today not having someone cross the finish line in 910 days? Yeah, the emotions, I mean, coming into Boston and um, it's definitely special running these marathons uh, this year, especially after COVID last year. A lot of us went through hardships. So we're reunited by running again. Yeah. And uh, I think we will always will be. Um, I think Boston is a community where we can all come together from around the world and uh, it's been just amazing support all throughout the course today I everyone was cheering in every single mile yeah. so it really goes to so, show something that people are out here and the community support is amazing all right, I really mean it when I say you are one of my favorite professional athletes of all time congratulations you. on your second place finish today and your first place finish yesterday thank you, thank thank you, you. so much she is no doubt an absolute symbol of courage and strength. Second place today for Tatiana, always a Boston favorite. Lisa, let's send it back to you.